What's shaking YouTube? Gores, the Emissary Sealed Product here with another uh, different video. Today, we're opening some stuff I've never opened before. Uh, recently got one of these, a Judgment of the L of the Light Deluxe Edition. Sorry, that was hard to say for some reason. Still sealed. And a Pokemon Shining Fates Elite Trainer Box. Both of these I've never opened before. I've opened, like, Judgment of the Light. I'll, uh, throw a link to an old cringy video, but I've never opened Shining Fates before. So I'm really excited about this. <laughs> well, first the giveaway, giving away a Ojama Emperor from Dual Overload and a Xerneas from Vivid Voltage. All you gotta do to enter for a chance to win this giveaway, hit that like button, be subscribed to the channel and drop a comment down below what your uh, favorite of these two sets is, Judgment of the Light or Pokemon, or if you prefer Yu-Gi-Oh to Pokemon. Like, I'm sure I'm gonna get a lot of mixed reviews here. But uh, let's let's get into it. You know what, I'm, since there's more stuff in the uh, Shining Fates box, I'm gonna go with that first. Here, let me, let me open this up off camera. So I got the Elite Trainer box unwrapped. We'll get into that in a second. I was looking at the little like sleeve around it and on the inside, it's just a bunch of friggin' pictures of shiny Pokemon. I don't know if anybody has really looked into this, but that is awesome. Like, that that's a nice little touch. <laughs> so, we've got our little box of Eevee goodies. So we got the book. We got all the energies and stuff. We got the Eevee VMAX. That's really cool. That looks super nice. So, keeping this sealed for sure. And we got our dividers, uh, our damage things that, like, I, I, I gotta say, I was spoiled with my first ETB with the metal ones, but these are cool. Got a uh, code card, boom, first to grab it gets it. What else? What else? Got the sleeves with the gigantic EV on it. the packs and i think there's dice in here yeah boom ev dice but what we're really here for so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten shining fates booster packs now we open the Yu-Gi-Oh version like when i got the uh shining fates etb a little while back i was just like hmm I wish there was a Yu-Gi-Oh version of this, and then I remembered these existed. Deluxe editions. They only did these for a few sets, and Judgment of the Light was probably the cheapest. Boom. There you go. There's one, uh, there's like two different collectible boxes you could get, but this is really cool. Super happy about that. Oh, and it's all car compartmentalized. So, you got, ooh, got the packs. These are, ooh, unlimited, but you only get nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it's almost an even match. And these, I forget what's in here. I'm gonna open this, because I don't think these are worth a crazy amount. That EV, on the other hand. Ooh. So we got a... Archfiend, ooh, print error, instantly worth thousands of dollars. Just kidding. Uh, Flying Sea and Dragon Shield. Equip only to a dragon type monster. I don't know why I decided to read it in that crazy announcer voice, but I did. Uh, but it comes with these awesome sleeves. I love these like true fit Zexel sleeves. I actually have a few packs of these. Like here's some, here's some silver ones. But just to show you, all you gotta do, slide it in, and they fit like perfect. Love it. So let me get this out of the way, and we'll finally open some packs. Since uh, Pokemon's got the head start advantage with the whole, you know, extra booster pack, we'll just get one out of the way before we start it. There's the code card, two, three, four. I guess like we don't have to do the card trick. 
but the card trick's super satisfying. <laughs> Cramorant, Spinarak, Snom, Grookey, Eevee, Morpeko, Reverse Snom, and woo, a Greedent V. That's a nice, creepy looking squirrel there. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna lie, the new fan, or the new fan, the new, like, era of Pokemon kind of confuses and frustrates me. <laughs> Boom. Like, some, some of the new Pokemon are really cool. Fire energy. But some of them are just ridiculous. Like, Rotom's cool. Trap Inches is an OG. It's just a weird fox. <laughs> Weasel, Coughing, Shinx, Eldegoss, and a Volcanion. Just want a shiny. <laughs> but jump over to the old favorite, the Yu-Gi-Oh, the Judgment of the Light. These are unlimited packs, but still a star eater out of this would be absolutely uh, amazing. XZ Reversal. Just bounce back and forth between the two. There we go. I'm slowly figuring it out. Pokemon pack. Oop, ruined it, but hey, that means it's a good one. Pokemon packs really uh, are built sturdily, I guess I could say. They're a lot harder to get into than Yu-Gi-Oh packs. Well, newer Yu-Gi-Oh packs. Old Yu-Gi-Oh packs, good God. Rowlet, more Pico, Spinarak. And Professor's Research. All right. Oh, and all the Judgment of the Light packs are upside down. Look at that. So unprofessional. <laughs> Let's go. Let's get something crazy. Star Eater Ghost is number one priority. There are ultimate rares. And nothing. XZ Agent. I honestly don't remember anything else in the set other than, uh, what's it called? Star Eater. Sorry. <laughs> Code. But all I really want is something shiny. I'd love to get the freaking Charizard. Just a shiny Charizard, one ETB. That would be, that would be the best. Coughing. Cacnea, Gossifleur, Snom, Boss's Orders Reverse, and a Luxray. Swear to God, I pulled that out of every uh, Pokemon set. <laughs> but let's go. Let's, I almost tried to do the card trick with the Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh, how foolish. Especially because I don't know where the foil comes. If it's before, oh, it's after the rare. Coach Captain Bear Man. That's just a ridiculous card. But we got an ultra rare. So first hit for uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. Let's go. Let's get some crazy shiny Pokemon. Ooh. Code card. Messing stuff up here. Four. Energy, Rotom, Floatzel, Rusted Sword, Morpeko, Coughing, Morty, I swear to God, if you knock something over while I'm recording, I'm going to be very mad. Q-Fan, oh, ooh, that's awesome, a shiny Lapras V, and a Celebi, but wow, that's an amazing shiny to get, look at that. Cats, swear to God. That's amazing. Sorry, my wife took uh, our youngest cat to the vet the other day. And uh, Morty, our oldest, he kind of thinks that Summer's the devil right now. Because she doesn't smell right. She smells like fear and the vet. Not like home. <laughs> Super Defense Robot, Sonic Boom, Bujin Incarnation. And Mecha Phantom Beast Cult Wing. That used to be good. All right, we got a shiny V. Let's get a shiny Charizard. I think Charizard's a V Max. I don't know. 
I try to know things about Pokemon, but honestly, I have no clue half the time. This just takes me back to, like, second grade. Tearing open packs, not knowing what the heck I'm doing. Just like, oh, I just need them for my binder. And now I just need them for my binder. <laughs> Choodle. Spinarak. Qfant. Another Gossifleur. Choodle with his ridiculous little tooth. And an Indeedee regular holographic. All right, so we have one Ultra from Jodel so far. We need to change that. <laughs> but this this wasn't actually all the, the the ETB was more expensive than this. But I still wanted to open it. And XZ reversal. Oh, what's that upside down card? Just because I opened up so much of Judgment of the Light and I opened or I I think I pulled the secret and the the ultimate Star Eater, but not the ghost. So if I pull the ghost, I get the trifecta. But if I pull the Charizard, it'll be the first holographic Charizard I've ever pulled. Ball guy. Tropius. Rusted Shield. Shinx. Coughing. Trap Inch. Rowlet. Choodle. Oh, Blitbug. Shiny. That's cool. And a Manaphy. Like, I don't think I've ever seen that Pokemon before in my life. But it's a shiny. So that's awesome. <laughs> Alright, Bujingi Warg. I wish I could have gotten some hidden fates before everybody found out it was an amazing set. Star Sailor, Seraph Sage, Archfiend Cavalry, and Fire Formation Yoko. Super rare. So we got another hit from Jodel. So, so far it looks like Pokemon is... Uh, Definitely winning this little scuffle we got going on here. So we got a code card. One, two, three, four. I wish Yu-Gi-Oh would do uh, the code card stuff for like dual links. Get like a pack or a booster box in dual links. That'd be amazing. Nicket. Horsey. Snom. Oop. More Pico, Tropius, and Dreadnaw. So we got we got three Jodel, two Shining Fates. We got a Madolce Chicolates. If anybody watches Ruxin Thirty Four, that's a favorite of his. <laughs> XZ Revenge Shuffle, Archfiend Palabrinth and reverse glasses. I'll have to like try and take a video of Morty and Summer and try and like splice it in in here so you can understand the ridiculousness we have to deal with. Ooh, oh, 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 ruining stuff. Oh, I'm ruining stuff, but it looked amazing. All right, there's the code card. One, two, three, four. Oh my God, if it's the Charizard, I might cry. <laughs> Luxio, Thwacky, Gossifleur, Snom, Trap Inch, Nicket, Buizel. Oh man! Shiny Ditto V Max. That is amazing. Holy god. I said I wanted shinies and I'm just getting shinies left and right. And another Celebi. Celebi's always with the shinies. That's so cool. Oh man. Holy crap. All right. All right. Super happy I bought that. I was just like, I don't need to buy a Shining Fates box. And I was just like, no, yeah, I need to buy a Shining Fates box. All right. Let's go. Let's get a Ghost or an Ulti. Anything will do. Tour Bus and Bujin Fidel. All right. Down to the last pack of each. Hopefully we get something crazy. So I mean we've got we've we've pulled crazy from Shining Fate so far. So anything else at this point is just icing on the cake. Oh god. I keep I keep seeing seeing stuff on the borders. 
Please be insane. Please be the Charizard. Fire energy, maybe it's a sign. Rotom. Rusted Sword. Eldegoss. Morpeko. Coughing. Gossifleur. Cacnea. Choodle. Reverse Gossifleur. And a Cramorant V. Definitely not a Charizard. But okay. Judgment of the Light. Last pack. Come on. If we can't get the Star Eater, at least like uh, Utopia Ray. I think that's what it is. I think that's the Utopia that's the cover card. It's like a $20 super. Nephantis, Brotherhood of the Fire Fist, Kieran, and Vane Betrayer. So only a couple hits out of Jodel. So I just got to say, Pokemon Blue Yu-Gi-Oh! out of the water. And I say that as a very big Yu-Gi-Oh! fan. Because got a Fire Formation Yoko and a Coach Captain Bear, man. I actually kind of love this card just because it's ridiculous. But that's all we got out of Jodel. Shining Fates, on the other hand, <laughs> we got Cramorant V. Got a Greedent V. We got a Pokemon I've never seen before, a Blip Bug shiny uh we got a lapras shiny and then we got a freaking ditto v max shiny this is nuts i'm so happy i bought this elite trainer box like th this was an amazing opening just because of the etb thank you guys for watching this video uh, i hope you all enjoyed it i know i did uh, remember if you want to enter for a chance to win this giveaway all you got to do Hit that like button, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, and drop a comment down below, which do you prefer, Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh? Or which set did you prefer, The Judgment of the Light or Shining Fates? Shining Fates was really awesome, not gonna lie. If I can find another ETB, I might buy it. But after you do that, go on over to my uh, social media, my Twitter and my Instagram. Make sure you follow me there. That's where I'll be announcing all the giveaway winners. I'll, uh, I have a giveaways highlights on my Instagram where I will save all of the giveaway winners from here on out. And on my Twitter, once I put it up there, it's up there. It's Twitter. You, you can't get that stuff off of there. <laughs> That's enough of that. Thank you guys again for watching. If you enjoyed the video and you want to watch more of my content, you can click on either one of these two links. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you next time, guys.